Matt Callan is looking down on us, very proud um, of something that he really kicked off with the NRL. So it's our job to, to push it and, and go as far as we can with that. And thanks to the NRL and thanks to so many people, uh, it's a special week in Rugby League, a, a week where I think Rugby League forgets a little bit about who's getting the two points and they come together as one for a common cause and it's just awesome to, to sit back and watch that. And, you know, nothing bigger than here at Newcastle and, uh, you know, uh, Venues New South Wales and uh, McDonald Jones Homes, they come together and they, they even name the stadium um, Beanie for Brain Cancer Stadium and it's just just adds to what is it going to be a huge night on uh, Friday night here. That's it, isn't it? Because as a foundation and uh, as a charity, when someone like Venues New South Wales, a big organisation, comes up, of course we will. Yeah, we'll help. Venues New South Wales, they come to us and they say, we want to help. And, and Brett Campbell, he really drives it. And he's the one last year that, that really come up with this concept. And Bill McDonald is a huge supporter of the Mark Hughes Foundation, so he didn't hesitate either. So these two great... Uh, companies come together and uh, didn't hesitate to give up their naming rights for, for a game, uh, to give it to us, which adds awareness, which means more people buy beanies, more people learn about brain cancer, and that's important because we need to know more, lots more about it. We've got, we've got a long way to go, but we're excited uh, at the platform we've laid. We're now ready to keep driving. And that's it, isn't it? That's the message, whether we're hosting functions, whether we're talking on television, that money makes the difference, doesn't it? If, if we can get beanies sold, make more money, research, awareness, and who knows what can happen. Yeah, look, nothing's changed in 20 or 30 years uh, for brain cancer, and we wanted, to, we wanted to change that, and we're working so hard to do that, uh, and we, we just need the support, you know? If there's people buying a beanie, we're, we're one beanie closer to finding answers, and we've got some exciting research, and we've got our scientific community We've got so many more plans, but it doesn't happen without money. That's a simple fact, and we just need that support. And we're in such a good position now, but we've got to keep driving forward um, until we find the answers. Uh, I need answers. So many people in the community need answers to brain cancer, and we need them fast. Was it a hard decision back then just to not put the doona over the head and go hard like you've gone? You just, you know, this, this, is, this, is, this is a life's mission now, isn't it? Yeah, in life, uh, we have to make choices and decisions, you know, small ones, big ones. And when I had this prospect of being diagnosed with high-grade brain cancer, I had, with my wife, Kira Lee, we had to make some choices and decisions really fast. And, um, yeah, I could have sat on the lounge and hoped someone else finds the answers, but when in your own life's riding on it, um, you get inspiration out of that and, you know, you've got to get up and do something. For, on behalf of Venice New South Wales and Donald Jones Stadium, we're really, really proud to, to be associated with the Marquis Foundation in this manner. Uh, it's Obviously, we, we have a lot of events and, and big things uh, that come through the venue, but uh, this one touches a little bit closer to home for us. Uh, we've got a really strong relationship with Mark uh, and to be able to get behind, change the name of the stadium, uh, encourage those to donate to it. such a wonderful cause. It, it's, uh, you're skipping to work for the week, absolutely. And, and to see the beanie go up above the, the stadium and the stadium to be renamed, there's a, there's a real sense of occasion, isn't there? Yeah, absolutely. So uh, it's great for the, the community to get, to get around it and get behind Mark. And uh, certainly from a, from, a, from a venue's perspective, to have the beanie on the front of the stadium, it just, uh, it's just a little bit of the icing on the cake uh, when, when people walk, in, walk through those turnstiles on, uh, on Friday night. Uh, we've been involved with the Mark Hughes Foundation for, uh, for a few years. And when we had the opportunity, when we, when we had the naming rights for the stadium and we saw what we could do uh, with this, and, and it's uh, great that the NRL has picked it up and called it the Beanies for Brain Cancer around. So what else could we do but put the beanie on top of the McDonald Jones and call it the beanie, uh, Beanies for Brain Cancer Stadium for this weekend? You come dressed for it, mate. You've come with the right apparel. Well, here it is. It is winter, and you, everybody needs to get one of these for the football on Friday night.